I'm Cody Cannon and today I'm going to show you how to adjust the brakes and the measure the chamber stroke length on a Army Freightliner. First thing we're going to do is go ahead and adjust the brakes. First thing you want to do is come up here, make sure this is loose. Once that's loose, you're going to come down here into your adjusting nut and looking through your inspection cover right here, you're going to tighten it up until the brake, the brake shoes touch the drum. They're touching right there, and then once they're touching, you're gonna back it off a half a turn. All right, after you do that, you're gonna come back up here and tighten this back up. Then you're going to come over to your next wheel, loosen the top bolt again. Once that's loose, come down here to your adjuster, tighten it up until the shoes touch the drum. They're touching right there. Back it off half a turn again. Alright. Then you're going to tighten this back up. Then you're gonna come up to your next axle. You're gonna do the same thing here. This up. Okay. Then you'll tighten your slack adjuster. Okay, we're touching right there. So then you're going to back it off half a turn again. Okay. Make sure you tighten this back up. Okay. 
Now you can come up and do your front axles. Alright. Like your back brakes. You don't come down here. Loosen that up a little bit. Come down to your slack adjuster. So tighten it. Okay. You know, back it off after turn. Once you get that tight back up, you come over to your other side. We'll do the same thing over here. Jesus, massive two six. Two six. That's not bad. <laughs> Once you loosen that, you come down here to your slack adjuster, start tightening that up. Alright, it's touching right there. And back it off after that. Alright, once you back it off after turn, you can tighten this back up. That's how you adjust the brakes. Next thing I'll show you is how to measure the chamber. Um, now I'm going to show you how to adjust or measure the chamber stroke. You don't need somebody in the truck for this one. First thing I'll do. You don't measure from the back of the chamber to the middle of the clevis, which is about is three inches. Hit the brake, and now it's at four, four and a quarter. That's inch and a half.
or an inch and a quarter of a stroke. So that's in spec. Usually it's between an inch to two inches of stroke. Let off. And you're gonna measure. The same thing over here. It's almost to three inches. Hit the brake. And that's gonna be uh, four and a quarter. So that's another inch and a quarter stroke. <laughs> Let off. Hit the brake. At four and a half. So that's an inch and a half. Let off. This one's at three. Hit the brake. And it moved to four and a half. So that's an inch and a half again. And now you can move up to do your front axle. So it's right at an inch, that's the spec. Let off. This one's at two and three quarters. Hit the brake. Move to four. So that's inch and a, inch and a quarter. So it's all in spec. And that's how you measure the it's like adjuster uh, stroke and how I adjust the brakes, the drum brakes on some of